Biodiversity describes the number of different species that live in an ecosystem. Okay, time for a quiz. Where would you find more biodiversity? A farm or a zoo? Farms tend to specialize in one or two species of plant or animal. While there may be high population numbers, farms have very low biodiversity. A zoo is a place where you go to see different types of life. A zoo is where you could see a variety of species. But farms and zoos aren't natural ecosystems. So let's see what else there is. Coral reefs have more biodiversity than any other aquatic ecosystem. Coral reefs are home to more than 4,000 different species of fish alone. On land, rainforests are one of the most biodiverse ecosystems. Many different species of plants, birds, insects, mammals, amphibians, and reptiles live in rainforests. Why is biodiversity important? Well, the more biodiversity there is, the more genetic diversity there is, and the more stable the ecosystem is. Would you be more stable hanging off a cliff by one string or by five? Would you be more stable relying on one single source of food or relying on five different sources of food? When there are many different types of species in an ecosystem, there are many different connections on the food web. Ecosystems with high biodiversity are more likely to recover from environmental changes. Here is a hypothetical ecosystem. It has low biodiversity. While there is a lot of grass, there is only one species of grass present. What happens if the environment changes and the grass is unable to survive? With no other types of plants present, how would the herbivores and the rest of the food chain survive? Because there is low biodiversity, this ecosystem has low stability. If the grass suffers in any way, all other organisms in the ecosystem would be affected. If there is a variety of plant species, then there is a variety of food sources. The more biodiversity there is in an ecosystem, the more stable that ecosystem is over time. The biodiversity of life supports our human needs as well. Materials for our clothing, materials for building, our sources of food, sources of medicine, and so much more are provided to us from different species. The stability of our global ecosystem depends on the biodiversity of life. The greatest threat to biodiversity is human activity and is our job to preserve and protect life on Earth.